Hello students, in today's lesson uh, I want to review with you addition and subtraction. Before I get started I want to tell you you have one week to finish your work and let's get started. Addition. Addition sign is plus and for today's lesson I'm going to show you what means addition and subtraction with regrouping. So here, is, here are a few examples. Our first example is 28 plus 18. So how I'm going to do this? 8 plus 8. We always start from the right and then go to the left. So first we uh, calculate our ones. 8 plus 8, 16. I'm going to write 6, 1. I'm going to transfer here because 1 is 10, so now I'm going to do my 10s. 1 plus 2 equals 3, plus 1, 4. So, 28 plus 18 equals 46. When I do this one, this means regrouping, because I have to regroup 1 here. Let's look at this example, 17 plus 59. Again, start from the right, go to the left. 7 plus 9 equals 16. I'm right 6, 1 I'm going to remember. 1 plus 1 plus 5 equals 7. So 17 plus 59 equals 76. Now let's have a look about subtraction. Subtraction sign is minus. Be careful. And here we are going to regroup as well. This means for example, 91 minus 25. 1 is small, so 5 is big. What does this mean here? For example, if you have one apple and I ask you, Oh, can you give me five apples? Can you give me five apples? No. Why not? Because you only have one apple. So what are you going to do to give me five apples? You're either going to buy some more apples or ask your mom. So in this case, this one is going to borrow from 9. So 1 is going to come to 9 and say, hey 9, can you help me? Can you give me 1? And I will say, yeah, of course I'll give you 1. So this one will become 11. And this 9 is no longer 9 because it gave 1 to 1, so it became 8. Okay, now you can look as 11 minus 5 equals 6 and 8 minus 2 equals 6. So 91 minus 25 equals 66. Let's look at our last example for today. So again, 4 is small, 6 is bigger than 4, so we need to regroup here. So I'll do like this. So this 4 will become 14, and this one will become 4. So 14 minus 6 equals 8, and 4 minus 2 equals 2. 54 minus 26 equals 28. And remember, it's all about practice. Don't use the calculator, practice your brain. Play lots of games that I have included in the video, and hopefully you have enjoyed my lesson today. Thanks for watching. Bye.